Oh, it's so nice and sweet and sunny again and I'm ready for another day at the Global Leader Experience. Oh yeah, waiting for the bus because today we're going directly to the field trip. Um, and I've been awake for two hours already, which is weird because it's only 8 a.m. And well, apparently my body got used to just sleeping six hours a day. So I just couldn't sleep anymore after six hours today. So yeah, whatever. I'm fine with that. Then I have more from my life and I don't sleep all of it, which is good. I've never been on the top floor of a Bristolian double-decker bus. So, until now. Until now. Now I am. Oh yeah. I can check that off my list. Um, I just don't ride the buses so often. I have a bike for everything, but we will be picked up at the venue to go to university and the, that's a private bus so it will be faster than I would be if I would take the bike so I basically have to uh, well I would have to leave my bike up there and then I would have to get up there anyway again so just take the bus in the first place probably the smarter idea um, yeah so that's what I do I would like to cycle because weather is really nice but oh well I would also like to stay outside because the weather is really nice but Oh well. <laughs> Here it goes. Wow, we're pretty much far out. It, it, it looks like we're on the country, well, well, not yet countryside, but uh, you know, not in the city anymore. Um, although we are definitely still in the city. Bristol is big, Bristol is huge. But I mean, there are trees and there's green stuff. Oh. And I'm way too early. I'm like 15 minutes early, but I thought better be early than late. It really looks like there are just houses where people live. So maybe I'm completely wrong. <laughs> Who knows? But if I remember correctly, map said I should go up that street and it should be somewhere over there. Okay, well, that looks more like business area. And here it is, South Mead Development Trust. And there are already people here that I know. Good morning. Ooh, and I'm already back at home. Already, yeah, it's dark outside. But whew, what a day. Wow, way too exhausting. I mean, it was really interesting at parts, but let's get through it. So, um, we went to the Development Trust, which is like a community center uh, in the south of Bristol. Um, and it was kind of interesting. We were shown around, we were told what they do, and then we could ask questions. Um, and then with the knowledge, we went back to our groups and discussed. Because each member of our group went to a different um, organization, and so we had a lot of things to do download um, and then we were discussing and then we had to come up with project ideas something that we could theoretically uh, realize here in Bristol what would make the city of Bristol smart um, and so we came up with one idea basically I mean it was a process um, and I mean, the main focus we had was in the beginning it was always about housing because if we would solve the housing problem, uh, crime rates would go down, unemployment would go down, uh, and so and it would help the community. Uh, and that's the main thing uh, we figured out that helping the community come together um, really helps the city. Um, and so, yeah, that was our main idea, but in the end we shifted uh, towards something that we thought we could realize. Um, and I'm not gonna talk about that today, maybe I'm gonna talk about that tomorrow, I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, um, it's... We'll see how, um, how we will get to um, develop uh, this idea. Basically, it's 
uh, a central web page where um, charities can offer uh, volunteer jobs and students would do them for some rewards um, that's the, the main idea but it, it's a lot more complicated but I don't want to talk about that because I talked about that the whole freaking day and that's why my brain is like stop it stop it stop it you need to sleep stop um, but yeah at first I need to eat and then I will sleep but no, I can't because at first I also need to pack for tomorrow because I will leave the Global Leader Experience early which I'm really sad that I have to do that because in the afternoon we'll have a celebration and all the people, and they are nice people, will come together and have some kind of party or so uh, and so I'm, re oh, I'm so sad that I'll miss that because in those three days I got to know a few people um, and I really like them already so and they're really interesting people and I want to keep having interesting conversations with, with them and so I'm already sad that it's over tomorrow and even more sad that I can't join that party um, but anyway I hope it's worth it because I'm traveling to Manchester um, where um, on Saturday and Sunday Mixed Tour 2 will be happening and I'm gonna play for Team 2 for um, Bristol mixed yay there is so much going on now oh if I would stay here then I would uh, have training with Mythigo all weekend because the weekend after this one uh, we are gonna play nationals so much is happening and then there are all these deadlines where I didn't finish the assignments yet and but my brain is today it's all like nope you can't do any work anymore you're overworked. Go to sleep, goddammit. Um, so, yeah. Whew. So exhausting. But, yeah. I mean, that's life. It's not gonna get any better at my work life, so I should enjoy while I'm still studying. Um, yeah, and you should make your backup. And then I will talk to you tomorrow.